So if I were if I were uh, Hunter Biden, I would be very scared. President Joe Biden's son Hunter Biden may be headed for a criminal trial. U.S. Special Counsel David Weiss said shortly after promotion into that role on Friday in a sign that courtroom drama could play an outsized role in the 2024 presidential election. Well, I think it raises a lot of questions. I think initially I said this is a this is a good thing and it's about time. But I think it raises a lot of questions, the timing particularly. A potential trial raises the possibility of an unprecedented spectacle in U.S. history. The son of a sitting president facing criminal charges while his father campaigns for re-election, likely against Republican Donald Trump, who faces at least three upcoming criminal trials of his own. The, the argument the other side would proffer would be this. Mr. Weiss is the, the, the individual who should investigate this, should be the special prosecutor in this case, because he's already amassed this evidence. He's already been investigating Hunter Biden for months, and he knows the lay of the land. So that's one side. The other side, of course, is, well, this is the individual who is poised to give a sweetheart plea agreement to the president's son. How can he be impartial and investigate this impartially from a, the point of view of a special prosecutor? Now, keep in mind, what is the point of a special prosecutor? It is somebody ostensibly outside the government, outside the Department of Justice, who doesn't bring anything to the table, who can take fresh eyes, impartially look at the facts, look at the law, and determine whether criminal actions has occurred. The witnesses will please stand and raise the right hands. Republicans in the House of Representatives are also threatening an impeachment inquiry into unproven claims that President Biden benefited from his 54-year-old son's business ventures. Do you solemnly swear or affirm that the testimony you are about to give is the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, so help you God? Yes, I do. I do. Let the record show that the witnesses... We have, you have, the interesting point is here, you have two competing investigations now, right? You have now ostensibly a special prosecutor investigation that's going on. You also have the House Oversight Committee and the House, House, uh, House of Representatives conducting their investigation. To the extent to which one starts to the House Oversight... Again, I, I think what's important here is the House Oversight's investigation uncovered facts which really probably pressured Mr. Uh, to the Attorney General to appoint uh, Mr. Weiss's special prosecutor here. So I think we're going to have to see where, where this leads. Um, again, time will tell. We're Weiss, who has been investigating Hunter Biden since 2019, filed misdemeanor criminal tax and gun charges in June, but a federal judge refused to accept a proposed plea deal. Weiss said in a court filing on Friday, that talks between the two sides have since broken down. The government now believes that the case will not resolve short of a trial, he wrote.